and we are observing how wacky and wild the sun is. You know what I'm saying? So don't take me seriously, bro. Take the sun seriously. And watch all the cool images that I'm showing you of the sun. So yeah, dots, the sun splatters some plasma on the camera. No big deal. It looks like the sun shot out a solar chicken, a solar snake. I don't know what that thing is, man. And this giant coronal hole, the dark blue area. That's the area I've been concerned with. I think it's a lot less hotter. So you got half the sun, the hot part's hot, and the cool side's cool. The sun is like a McDLT at the moment. It's got its hot side, it's hot, and its cool side, that it's cool. Though technically, the sun is never cool. If you walked up to it and placed your hand on it, you would definitely get at least third degree burns. All right, who's ready for some crazy solar science? We're mainly just gonna observe and say, what the hell? We've got a video message. I'm gonna have to science the shit out of this. Hit the button, baby. Stay cool. This is a Thor News presentation. Thor News presents. I mean, the sun looks kind of ratty and nasty. Looks like it has been rode hard and put up wet. Looks like it had another wild night. Yeah, it looks nasty. Are you okay, baby? You need, to, you need to settle down. You need to curtail your activity. Click, click, boom. There's a boom on the 12th, and then we got another boom on the 13th and the 14th. Boom, boom. Chicka, boom, boom. Chicka, yeah, chicka what? Chicka, okay. We're looking at Earth scale compared to the sun scale, and the Earth is tiny. I don't know if you know that, but the sun is giant, and the Earth is tiny in comparison. And if you notice the sun baby area, it's been active and it shoots out some stuff, almost like a shotgun. Hey, maybe the sun has different holiday schedules than us, and the sun got its sun baby a rifle, and so it's just shooting its rifle. That's no big deal. It's probably just a solar BB gun, although those can put an eye out. Whereas some weirdos only like one left eye, I prefer the left eye, the right eye, and sure, the third eye, the mind's eye, if you will. No, that'll probably freak somebody out, but man, y'all, some of y'all freak out about everything. Like, that's your natural state. I'm just gonna freak out. So, okay, freak out. Do what you want to do with this solar Thor News dance party. Where the filaments we're looking at are pretty giant. My three-year Thor News anniversary will be November 23rd, and I've been watching these cameras since then, and the filament activity has been increasing in size and WTF-ness. You know, and some science guys are like, I want to talk about all the stuff I can explain. That's cool. From what I understand, that gets you steady paychecks. But I'm like one of the guys. I'm one of the guys who wants to talk about the stuff you can't explain. Like, what is that stuff shooting out of the sun? Man, it looks like a giant skeleton, bird skeleton, phoenix skeleton, you know? I mean, look at the Earth's size compared to these filaments. I think that's the same region that's just been rico, suave. Inactivity and filamentation and solar flares and coronal mass ejections. 